Hey, Chris from the Mighty Decibel here. Welcome back. Well, we passed by the midpoint of the year, so we're going to continue on with our fourth and last edition of our albums, to, uh, favorite albums to date. This time looking at extreme metal. So we're talking about death, thrash, and black metal, of course. Uh, and we've got six albums to talk about today, so let's get into it. So before we begin, I should note that we're doing this alphabetically. We're not into the ranking yet. We'll leave that to the end of the year. And our first uh, fave extreme metal album of 2022 to date is the self-titled debut by Elizabeth, uh, the one-man band of Joe Steele of Ice War fame. So clearly Elizabeth is an homage to Bathory's self-titled debut, taking us back to black metal's first wave. Uh, the composition, delivery, delivery, and production is bang on here, uh, making sure that lovers of that Bathory debut are going to go absolutely nuts over this one. All hail the first wave. highlighted extreme metal album of the year to date is from Phoenix Arizona's Savage Necromancy with an album called Feathers Fall to Flames so if you're looking for some bludgeoning black death verging on uh, war metal territory you've come to the right demolition derby uh, hard as nails riffing terrific action pack rhythm section and gutter dwelling vocals it's all here for you to pray pleasure Next up is our fave straight up death metal record of the year to date from Beyond the Burial Ground by Sepulchral. Uh, so this debut full length uh, by the Spanish Horde is definitely for the old school death metal fan out there hitting hard and fast. But what really stands out is the superb drumming by Gorka Perez who double duties here on guitar as well. So the drum patterns relentlessly set the pace, egging all other performance, uh, performers to keep up with the assault. Excellent up-tempo death metal.
you found that Midnight's latest venture was a little underwhelming, I suggest that you press up to the bar and ask that Deadly Intrusions by Scum Strike be played over the loudspeakers. So, uh, Black Speed Metal is Scum Strike's game, and on this debut full length, the Montreal Quebec unit absolutely terrorized with deadly precision on this 11 track, 32 minute uh, blitzkrieg of a record. No nonsense, up your ass metal. Sweden for our next highlighted release, The Sanctity of Death by Ultra Silvum. So we're talking about evil black metal here uh, with strong songwriting taking center stage. Uh, uh, track differentiation being a highlight, the core of this is speedy 90s blackness, but there are also references to uh, trad, speed, and atmospheric black metal, along with the odd sound effect keeping you on your toes, a unique sounding unit that deserves your attention. to San Antonio, Texas for our sixth and final fave uh, extreme metal record of 2022 to date. It's Rip and Tear by Exile, spelled X-I-L. Uh, so nothing fancy here, just straight line speed metal uh, for those uh, requiring jet fuel for their listening pleasure. Uh, Self-described as breakneck rock and roll, uh, the pistons popping, drumming, and hair rising uh, riffage ensure that even the most ardent need for speed will be satisfied. Best get size for a neck brace when listening to this thing. Decibel's fave extreme metal albums of 2022 to date. Did we miss anything? Throw them down below in the comment section so everybody can check them out. And remember to check in every Monday for our new release Monday episodes. Tuesdays we have our curated playlists in 40 minutes. Wednesday we have our live and album reviews. And Thursdays we have our best of top tens. You know where to find it. www.themightydecibel.com Have a great one, eh? Bye.